Hi everyone, I'm Michelle from Colme Group and I want to show you a workaround for putting a Gantt chart in your dashboard without having a direct card. I'm going to start using an example from my test space and this template for construction management plan. The first step is to go to your Gantt chart, which is over here. When you push on the Gantt chart, now I have my Gantt chart view here. I'll come back up and click on the Gantt chart and we see that we have a paper clip right up here in the corner that says copy link. So I'm going to copy that link. Now I'm going to move over to my dashboards and here's my dashboard test site. And I will add a card and that's going to be an embed. So you come down here to embed and we're going to do the custom embed. And I'm going to call that uh, name it construction and chart. And I'm going to paste my link right here and add that card. The way it works here is it's going to paste it in as if it's a tiny web browser window. So it still has all of the information here and we can make it a little bit bigger, but you will need to use your scroll bars to see the entire Gantt chart if it is a fairly large or lengthy Gantt chart. The other thing that you can do is to come over here to Gantt options and there is a toggle switch to see it in full screen mode. So even though I'm on my dashboard right now, if I click this, it gives me the full screen view. To get back to my dashboard, I hit escape and I'm back at the dashboard. Any other cards I would have here, for example, a battery chart or a counter uh, of tasks to complete or completed uh, could be below this. I hope that helps with your dashboards. Thanks for watching.